What's up my Terror Tots, Mosh Potatoes here with another random class video, this time on Infinite Warfare for the first time. So the class is the ERAD with the RAW as a secondary, two jammer grenades, and the only perk is Tracker. It didn't say anything about attachments, so I just put on Grip and Quick Draw because I had extra slots for it. And also with this new uh, random class generator thing it gives a name for the class and this class is apparently called the unaccountable girl so let's see if it's any good I'm ready oh look it ninjas online <laughs> guess what chicken butt one v woman kid keep backing out you scared ninja you scared <laughs> look at my movements all day every day all right gonna kill this guy no problem head back over here go down here that guy's behind me. I'm gonna go prone. Just like I drew it up. Gonna go over to the turquoise building because it's ugly. Ooh, gonna pick up this nice double kill real quick. Let me see how I didn't kill him real quick. Okay, cool. We are losing by a lot. So that's already a pretty good sign. This guy's camping because everyone camps right there because they think they're actually good at the game, but you're not good at the game. Take away your G Fuel. Take away your control freaks, take away your good internet, take away your headset, you're just like a girl with makeup, you think you're all pretty and take off the makeup and it's like... Okay. I mean, that's what the, all these players think they are, they think they're good with all their uh, little gizmos and gadgets that give them advantages that normal people don't have. Like, first off, this guy needs to get muted, and you're gonna get me killed. Like, just shut up, no one cares. It's like, you're not good at the game if you need an advantage over people. Like, come on. It's just ridiculous. Put yourself on an even playing field. And then be better than all those people. And then you're good. But if you need an advantage, you're just admitting that you suck. I mean, come on. Like, this thing your future whole clip to kill people on. Much. Who's talking? Who are all these people that interrupt me? Golly. Look at him. Oh, oh, I got a double kill. And he gets the triple. Of course I did. We're gonna use the secondary. Why not? It's on the class for a reason. The unaccountable girl. These iron sights are a little... I mean, you can see them. It's just a little weird. I don't know why you'd pick that design over other designs, but then again, I'm not a gun expert. So... Uh... I don't know why people do certain things. See, I'm really not that bad at Call of Duty. I just don't want people to expect great gameplays from me all the time. Because then that puts more stress and pressure on me. Which I don't want. Because then that doesn't make gaming fun. Like, I used to be a super tryhard back in the day. Like, because I was playing on PS3 back on Call of Duty 4. And you can make as many accounts as you wanted for free. And I took advantage of that. And if my stats weren't good, I would delete the account. And just start over again. And there was a point where I had a 40 KD on one of my accounts. Like, it was bad. And basically, I just, like, took a step back and I was like, why am I doing this? This isn't even fun. So then I stopped being a tryhard and I just want to have fun in games. So, am I capable of doing well? Yes. Am I trying to do well? No. I'd rather be, like, the goofy person that I am, so... That is why you don't see crazy good gameplays out of me. Surprise attack! That's the point. We gotta be random. We got the double kill with the raw? A triple? What is this? Let's just keep going. Four? Four kills in one life with the raw. I'm so raw right now. More raw than an onion. I don't. I don't know what that's supposed to mean, but I said it, and I feel like I'm gonna sneeze. I don't want to sneeze. So whatever. Don't trick shot me. Don't ever disrespect me again. I had to go get a tissue because my nose was starting to like leak, snot. Which is not fun, and uh, you know, Kleenex never called me back. And well, I never called them, but I'm actually considering emailing them 
and just like, yo, I really want you to sponsor me. Which usually isn't like how it works. Usually they have to come to you. But I tweeted them once with the whole, I'm only going to get sponsored by O'Reilly, Totinos, and Kleenex. And they favorited the tweet. So something's brewing between us. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to go back to using the Raw. I was actually doing somewhat decent with that. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, go ahead and leave a like and subscribe for more, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.